Palace booked into Winter Sun Caravan Park only for one night as um, we are heading down to Yulara pretty much straight away. Tomorrow we're just in Alice just to fill up fuel, gas and of course our fridges. I'd say we're pretty lucky to get in actually. We got um, one of the last spots in the caravan park because the I think rally race is finishing today. Um, so yeah, pretty lucky there. Um, probably won't get much filming done as we have so much to do. So we're gonna crack on and we will probably next see you at Kings Canyon. Currently eating lunch while looking out over Alice. I actually seen this little spot on the news not so long ago, which I'm about to show you. It's where all the unused planes worldwide are parked up at the moment in Alice Springs. There are so many planes. This is as good as I'm going to get for you, but there is Singapore, Cafe Pacific, Qantas, Virgin, Scoot, Tiger, China Southern, Jetstar, loads. It's crazy. the fire i don't know what's going on over there but we'll move it along and look at this view that is king's canyon over there we're gonna walk that rim tomorrow i think it takes about four hours so this is our little stop over tonight for an early start tomorrow nice cool walk but look at that sun on it Obsessed with this sky. Obsessed what is that? Is that a fire? It's a hazard. All right, you lump. Chief me all one job. <laughs> Kings Canyon Rim Walk and we did read about this. There's 500 steps up to begin with. So we see you at the top. So it's almost the top. My bloody heart's racing. Good? <laughs> Just about. Whoa. Yeah, that's a bit hardcore those, those steps. But still got some more to go. So I think we're at the top. Well, nearly at least. And my heart is going mental. I thought I was quite fit, but obviously not. Out one of two. Bloody huge. Can't even see the bottom for them. 
but this is about as hard as the track's got so far. It's still pretty easy, pretty good. reason I got that sign there, no climbing. I don't know how much that would take before it falls and she's a long old way down. Not looking forward to them stairs over there. currently on our way to the Garden of Eden Lookout. What are you looking at? Check out that tree down there. It's like falling over and then another one. swim anyway because it's freezing. That reflection on the water is insane. You do a good job. Oh. You fell. How's those new shoes? Don't break them out to anyone. The new sketches she's got. They're not sketches. They're sketchy. Miles away. So close yet so far. So there we go. We've done it. The rim walk. Good? Yeah. Happy with two and a half hour finish line. Wow, I think that may just be one of the best walks I've done. It doesn't even feel like a long walk because you're always in awe of the next rock face that your head turns to. Anyway, I'll stop rambling. We are going to try and make it as close as possible to Uluru tonight. So we are going to now hit the road and we will see you wherever we get to. We managed to get to a free campground called Curtain Springs last night. I want to say we're about 100k's from Uluru. So we're just about to have some breakfast and then we're going to head on in. We're going to go try get into Ayers Rock Campground, which I believe is on a first come first surf basis, just like Lake Argyle. So fingers crossed we get a spot, but I have read that there is an overflow area, so I think we should be fine. It's the Ayers Rock Campground, and um, didn't know that pool here, but I don't think I'll be going in there. It's a bit, a bit too cold, but there's a fair old queue still. There'd be 30, yeah, I'd say about 30 caravans in front of us. But uh, old mate just told us to park over there and wait. Well, we got in. We got an overflow spot, which is pretty good because it's cheaper. And we get loads of space down here. Look at the size of it. 
wow, it's insane. from the shop we are off to sunset viewing area at Uluru we just got ourselves some like nibbles some like biscuits dip cheese and I also got myself a new hat been looking for one of these for ages but none of them seem to fit but I finally got one what do you think so how good's this we've pulled in for an afternoon of well, and dinner. Afternoon sort of drinks and something to eat, nibblies. absolutely freezing outside I've got our takeaway coffees on the go and we're just about to get rugged up and head to the coach that is picking us up at 10 to 6 it best be worth it so we're just in time and we jumped out of the car and literally the bus has pulled up just as we walked over here which is bloody good I'm hoping it's not like the uh, Lake Argyle one where we jump in there and it's freezing cold it looks pretty busy in there, so I guess we'll jump on. We're on. We've made it on. It's, um, <laughs> air conditioning is on. I can confirm. <laughs> Freezing cold, but it looks like a packed house. So. A couple of seats around us remaining, but I'm sure they'll be taken up pretty quick.
Some lights are slowly turning white. And there's Uluru in the back. That was amazing. I don't feel like my camera's done it any justice though. I just don't feel like it caught the color as vibrant as it looked to the eye, if that makes sense. Um, and also the sunrise was a bit of a letdown. We've had clouds for a few days now, but hey ho, you can't have it all. Um, but it was definitely, definitely worth the freezing cold and the early wake up call. Uh, we're off to Kata Juta today. It's about 50 k's. We'll um, head in there, have a look around, and then try and get out of this park tonight. Get back to, what's it called, Springs? Curtain. Curtain Springs. We'll get back there. Or even further. We'll see how we go. But um, we're just going to scan our ticket and then get in there, I guess, because it's all in the same park. <laughs> how much you can hear because of the wind but we are just about to do the Warpa Gorge walk at Kata Juta. You're like impressed that. aren't you that I remembered all that. Um, yeah it takes about an hour they say, uh, 2.6k so let's get that done because I am freezing. Cold? <laughs> you want to go back? <laughs> We really are struggling. <laughs> That's it for this one guys, we are now heading back up to Alice Springs, so thanks for watching and we will see you on the next one.